So stupid GPS. Stupid GPS seems to think this is IKEA. Uh, the GPS was bought before IKEA was made. No, it wasn't. Don't blame the GPS. No, IKEA was always at that location. They just tore the old one down and built a new one. Oh. So yes, I am blaming the GPS because I really have to pee. Like I drink, which is stupid, but I was de I felt dehydrated and my sugar was like all over the place because I'm a diabetic, if you don't know. Um, so I drink like a liter of water before leaving. Well, I peed before, anyways. Now I really have to pee, and we're now we're another ten minutes away. But here's some free furniture if anybody's interested. So I found, I googled the address, and I think we know where we're going now. It just sucks because I really have to pee. Ladies, you know what I'm talking about. Here's the IKEA entrance. Ooh, food. What's that? Something for a dollar. Breakfast. Oh. See, there's a coffee press. Not coffee and tea maker, $9.99. I already have a coffee maker. And cups and I bought one of these because I saw Anna Sacconi had one. And I thought they were so cute. I was like, oh. I want one because they're really cute and pink and they're awesome. What? Mm. You can get something too. For someone who wasn't really keen on coming, Zachary's picking up quite a few things. <laughs> Look at that. A strainer. Some, all this stuff. Now he's looking at, what is that? It's a garlic press. I've always said to myself, why don't we have a garlic press? <laughs> I was not being sarcastic. <laughs> $10. Well, do we need a $10 garlic press? Well, the alternative is to cut it up by hand. It's up to you. $59.99, something random. Mm. Mm. Decisions. Rug decisions. Can't make a decision. $49.99. Now or never. It's a shag carpet. Reminds me of the scene in that movie with Russell Brandt and uh, Jonah Hill. Oh, just, I just lost my sandal. These are $49.99. Huh. Not bad. Ooh, I love this one. Uh, of course. It's more expensive. Well, mm. I don't think we're buying one today. I don't think so either. I think we're going to wait. Yeah, we're going to paint that room. Hate paint the room. We'll, we'll yeah. In there. But at least now we know this is where they come for a rug. Yeah. It's different. Not I need an interior designer because I'm shit at picking up this stuff. I like that. It's different. See, oh, I like that one with the blue. I like that blue. That's the blue I want. If anybody's good at interior design wants to give us advice, Feel free. Yeah, two ninety. Of course, I like this one. Yes. You look for the price tag first, then you look at it. <laughs> I love this one. That's not bad. I love that. That's cool. Different and dark, so I can't. Not when I drop something, I don't feel so bad about it. Nice. That one's different too. I've lost my husband. Oh, there he is. Hmm, fourteen ninety nine. What do you think? It's you. I won't kill it, I promise. Okay, because the last one's still alive. Just as a flower. What's the lot? Okay, do I have a white or a purple one? I can't remember. It was a white one. Wasn't it? So I should get a purple one? Sure. Okay. Where well, there's yellow. That one's. You like that one? It's tiny. It's very small. Yeah, I like a big one. I want a big one. This one? Okay. I won't kill it. True. You need to actually open the blinds in the living room. I will. It's not going in the living room. Probably in the woman cave. Well, I don't even know. Why am I getting it? Where am I going to put it? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I just seem really pretty. Impulse. Impulse. Bad. 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 See? Ice cream. 
dinner is served. Hi, I'm just in my living room. It's pretty cozy and uh, I like it. Here's my other couch. That's my daughter, um, Fannie Mae, and my son, Jimmy Bob. And there's her, my parents, Fran and, uh, and uh, Frank. And there's my TV. Oh, there's my husband. I don't see why all these price tags are here. Don't get it. I'm just sitting at home, um, reading Oprah magazine with a chai, you know? Relaxing. I like this couch. Yeah? Ah, it's comfy. Doesn't work hard, though. No. I like this, too. Very nice. Hey, guys. So, I, I decided to redecorate. Um, so, here I am in my living room again. Look at it. I, uh... I have the price tags on everything, so I like to know how much I paid, but there's my, and then I put that over there. Oh, nice, smart. It's my living room. And, uh, yeah, I'm just chilling out. Oh, hey, Zach, what are you doing here? I like this one. I really like that coffee table. I could probably build something like it, but let's see how much it is. Yeah, for $39, the amount of time it's going to take me, I must be better off buying it. That's a sustainable home? Wow. Huh. And how big is our house? Twice? I like that. I like those baskets. I like those pictures. I like this living room. Cozy. Very cozy. Well, hello again. I'm just laying in my lounge area. And uh, yeah, again, I've de redecorated again. I know it's crazy, but uh, pretty is that. I love that. And that's actually something we're thinking about storage like that up there. I'm not very fond of this storage area. Yeah, my feet are up. Love this color. It's kind of a color we're thinking of for our living room. But getting lots of ideas. I like this too. Ugh, I can't get up now. This couch is not my friend. It's not fat girl friendly, but I love the color. Two twenty nine. That's way more expensive than the other one I saw. Are you having fun? Yes. <laughs> Mister, I don't want to go to IKEA. What the hell am I gonna do at IKEA? You don't have to buy anything at IKEA. Just the ideas you get are amazing. Cause we mean we restore our own furniture, so. Oh, do we need some? No. So, you know, you get a lot of ideas just by looking around and, you know, and seeing what's in style and what the colors are. And I'm having a blast and we hardly have to spend any money. So, looks like this. Look. Yep, about that. Maybe a little bit smaller. So, we're kind of looking at TV stand ideas. We may get a new TV. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> He's convincing me to get a new TV and then take our old TV and put it in possibly our new bedroom. It's a lot of possibly right now. That's a good one too. Ooh, hello. Yeah. Lots of ideas. They're super cute. Oh, $2.99. Well, no, we have oven mitts. It's just, I think these, you don't burn yourself as much. Leave me alone. I'm an adult. I can do what I want. I'm trying to figure out if, we need, if I need an apron or not. It's cute. No kids. It's cute too. I don't know. Oh, that's so pretty. Aww. How sweet that is. What? I'm just saying it's cute. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Ooh, stop it. Stop giving it to me. <laughs> if you want it, get it. This is why I have a shopping problem. Oh, these are $7.99. Oh, that's for men. Ooh, Zachary. Oh, look at this one. $5.99. It's got sharks on it. I cook shirtless. <laughs> Zachary, don't knit that on camera. Nobody needs to hear that. Okay. So I got um, Draws for 99 cents. This thing. 
How much was this? Ten? Something like that. And we're moving. We're moving. These clip things. Chip bag clips. Not chip bag, but clips for dollar ninety-nine. This thing to put kitchen stuff in. Utensils. Utensils six ninety-nine. These ice cube trays are a dollar something. And then I got one for me, one for my sister. These cups, they're three forty-nine. And then a third one just because. And we're moving. Salt pepper shakers, they're three something. A tea holder thing, two ninety-nine. Scarf holder. No, you can't have that one. It's for me. Nine ninety-nine. The gorilla. So that's awesome. Like we're gonna grill fish and stuff. That's twelve ninety-nine. And this airtight container for six ninety-nine. So that's our haul for IKEA. Whoever get out of here. So while we were at checkout, they showed us like the frozen foods and stuff. And you can buy the meatballs. I didn't know that. So uh, we bought the meatballs we had and we got the cranberry sauce too. S I want to say this was $7.99 and the sauce was like $2.99. So I think. Hold on. Uh, yeah, the meatballs were $7.99 and the sauce was $3.49. So that was a pretty good deal. I'm excited to have that next week at home. So off. Off we go. I don't know where. I'm kind of tired. We were in there for like four hours. It was crazy. I didn't think we were going to be in there that long. So, I liked it. I liked Ikea. Didn't love it. I just find something, some things were, the things that were on special were a good price. Um, but, some stuff was really expensive and I find that you could go to like a furniture store and get it, if not for the same price, sometimes a little bit cheaper and it comes assembled. And it's a bit of a higher quality. So I'm on the fence. I liked certain things, but certain things I was like, but the things we bought, like the little kitchen stuff and the whatever, that was fine. But the furniture is kind of like, it got really good ideas, but I still believe in the craft craftsmanship of solid wood furniture, you know? Finding stuff on the side of the road and sanding it, painting it, and making it my own. But definitely got a lot of good ideas, right, Zach? Yep. He liked it. You liked it. Yep. Yeah. It's good? Yep, it's good. Yeah. We're just very tired. We got there at four. We were there three hours. Like it's not a it's not a go five minutes in there. It's a three hour lots of walking. Got our exercise. We burnt off that chocolate cake. So we're just gonna stop by his office for a second while we're in town and I'm getting a coffee. <laughs> and I'm dying for a coffee and then go home and get ready for tomorrow. I'm going with my sisters out for lunch and I have a doctor's appointment and then um, they're coming to install our new internet tomorrow so I'll finally be able to upload all these vlogs I've been filming and videos and, and all that. So fun times at least now we're not going through rush hour and i don't have to pee that i think is the best part about leaving ikea bye ikea thank you for um providing food and cheap products